Welcome to GSTL people and I've got this Vauxhall Tigra in and I'll show you what needs to be done to remove interior seats as you can see these ones are quite crappy so we'll be replacing them with some nice heated seats and yeah so let me set this thing up and we'll crack on so to remove them you need to remove the seats you need T40 T40 bit like that and this is the front of the seat basically push it as far as you can back and T40 fits inside there you might have a different tool but this is what I have unfortunately but just get these two off in the front and uh then we'll proceed to the back. This is what we've got. And basically do the same on the other side. Right, there we go, eventually. So it's T40, this side is quite a bit awkward to get into, so I need to have some small, I don't know why they made it like that, but this doesn't go any further back anymore, so yeah, pain in the ass, I have to say that. This is what's going to help me save my life. Should be my life savior, please be. Jesus Christ. What the hell? Well, be aware people, it might be a hard job to get it out. Because I am having a nightmare. Hey, hey, eventually, what a bugger, it's because of this thread lock, that's what it is, and then we go to the back and we have basically exactly the same, and it's exactly the same T40, and just undo it in. Actually, so you can see. There we go. Back ones are much easier. Right, now 
we have what do we have here we have this thing here so just pull it out and then this slides out like that and just pop that pop that whole thing out and there we go that's one seat's gone uh, other side other side is basically exactly the same same pain in the ass that it's gonna be so yeah this is this is what you gotta do to remove the seats for the front and then another thing if you are putting if you are putting um heated seats the heater controls are normally here so what you do is pop that i know your mom probably said don't put your fingers in holes that you're not supposed to put your fingers in but put your finger in there pull it out and that's your wiring harness for passenger side and driver side so just swap it all out uh, make sure you get the control buttons from the donor car or if you're buying them because they're gonna cost you a little bit more separately but yeah that's it really so that's what you do to remove uh, seat on a Vauxhall Tigra I believe this is like 2005 or 6 or something like that but it doesn't matter so yeah thanks for watching I uh, hope you enjoyed it and like and share and I'll catch us in the next one. Ta-ra!